The Supreme Court has been asked to scrutinise the state government's decision to approve an expansion of the Abbott Point coal terminal in North Queensland. The latest legal action has been brought by a group of Whitsunday residents concerned the project will damage local tourism. Another day, another court challenge to Adani's Carmichael coal mine project in the Bowen Basin. This time, the objection comes from a group of Whitsunday residents. They're worried about water quality, but more importantly, they're worried about their jobs. They fear the planned expansion of the Abbott Point coal terminal near Bowen will have grave consequences for the Great Barrier Reef and tourism. The project will see 1.1 million cubic metres of seabed dredged and dumped on vacant land beside the existing terminal. The residents say the state government failed to comply with its legal duty to consider all the ramifications. We see there's been a bit of a ticker box exercise here attaching conditions rather than a genuine consideration of whether the project should be refused. Adani says its Queensland project has been subject to 10 court challenges and the impact of the activist-driven delay will be felt most keenly in Bowen, a community crying out for jobs and investment. That's absolute rubbish. We are professional lawyers. Don't forget Adani, Adani has lost a number of the cases in court. The opposition wants an overhaul of the appeals process. This is a project that has been through rigorous environmental uh, approvals processes at both state and federal level over the past six years. In our democratic society, everyone has the right to object. The remedy is to make the process more efficient. The case will return to court in October. Daya Clark, ABC News.